whenever you're creating your CV for graduate school, the main thing that you need to focus on here is tailoring the CV to the specific kinds of programs that you're applying into. So let's say you're applying into an engineering master's degree, for example, right? If you're doing that, you want to make sure that anything that's on your CV has to do with your experience with engineering. So you want to emphasize first your academic experience. That's going to be really important. What key courses have you taken? Maybe research that you've done, right? What professors have you worked with? These are the key things that you're going to want to emphasize. And you want to show clearly what skills you have related to engineering, maybe several coding languages that you know, right? Maybe your familiarity with robotics. There's a million different things that you could list here, right? And it depends on the specific kind of program that you're going into. But that's the thing that you want to make clear is what are your academic and intellectual capabilities and what is your background in that field? Okay. Then you want to look at the work side of things. Maybe you've done internships for certain robotics or engineering firms, right? Then you talk about your experience there and make sure that you're emphasizing the key things that you accomplish, right? What you learned, what skills you use. That is kind of like the main thing that you would want to do with any of your work experience items. So that would be the main thing when you're ever you're applying into graduate school and looking to tailor your CV to your graduate programs, make sure that you're really emphasizing the things that have to do with the specific field that you're applying into. And don't look over the academic factors. Don't think that you only have to include work factors because that's not true. You can put both. They're both important.